Good morning, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm about to go grocery shopping. It's like, I think it's like eight in the morning. I don't know. I woke up pretty early today because uh, I'm excited about this video. So I am going to be making like TikTok recipes all day, essentially. Um, <clears throat> pretty much the only reason I use the app is for recipes and shit. And I have like a huge saved folder on Instagram and it's just like full of cool recipes. So I thought it'd be cool if I did like a breakfast, lunch, and dinner, but trying like viral TikTok recipes. I don't know, I like to cook, but I'm excited to try these recipes out. So I'm gonna go to Walmart and get some shit. So I just got all my groceries and I'm super excited <laughs> to get to cooking and I also grabbed a Starbucks I'm gonna try this with you because I've been obsessed with the sweet cream foams recently and apparently they have like a chocolate one So I'm gonna try this one with you. I've tried them all except for this one. So Oh my god, this is really good because I like how there's like the bitter black coffee and then you have a little sweetness because I'm not super big on sweets and this is like a really good balance and the chocolate foam is really good so yeah y'all we're about to head home and I'm gonna get to cooking I'm so excited to try these recipes out we're gonna be eating good today I know that all right you guys so I finally made it back home from grocery shopping I got Hella shit, and I'm super excited. Um, mainly because I got a new cutting board. You guys, I've been using this shitty ass. Let me show you. So I've been using this for a while, and I got this at the dollar store. Pretty generic, you know, nothing special. And I've been wanting a nice, big, wooden one. And I've been eyeballing this one for a while. So I was like, you know what, let me just fucking get this. Because if I ever want to make like a charcuterie board, I could use it for that. Um, and I can also, you know, cut shit on it. And it has like these grippers on the bottom. So it's really nice. So the next thing that I got, I'm super excited about, and it is these plates. <laughs> I've been eyeballing these for quite a while. And if you if you shop at Walmart, I'm sure you've seen these. It's by the Pioneer Woman. And she has so much like cute shit. And it's all like really grandma chic. I don't know, it's very nice, very cute. So I'm mostly excited about this one. I love this design and I'm definitely gonna get more of these just because I like how they look. So I'm excited to eat off of these today. <laughs> so for the recipes, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I'm cooking for breakfast. So I saw this on TikTok a while back and I was like, yo, I have to make this. So I love hard boiled eggs. I like everything about this just looks good to me. So I bought everything I need and we're about to recreate this for breakfast. So this is gonna be a pretty simple breakfast. Um, so I got, like I said, the mayo sriracha, which is an interest. I don't really like mayonnaise, but I do like sriracha. So I think that'll work good. I got the eggs and then I got some sourdough bread. I feel like that was closest to what she used in the TikTok, so. So I just finished cooking. This is what the little egg sandwich looks like. It looks really fucking good. Damn. I think it would be even better if I had fried some bacon and put that on top of it. I'm gonna give this breakfast a eight out of 10. It would have been a 10 out of 10 had I fried some bacon with it. But other than that, this shit slaps. So you guys, I'm gonna finish eating and my dad is actually going to be here in a few minutes because he's going to hang my TV in the living room. So as you guys can see, our living room is looking pretty fire at the moment. I got, we got the kitties taking naps right now, but we got this new entertainment center and all we need now is to put a TV up here. He is on his way to help me do that because I don't know how to mount a TV to the wall. So. 
You guys, I just rolled <laughs> a fucking jablunt. Because I rolled a joint at first, and I'm out of Swishers. And I was really wanting a blunt, and I had some leftover backwoods. <coughs> so after I rolled the joint, I took my backwood leftovers and just like wrapped it in it. So it's a mixture between a joint and a blunt. <laughs> so, I'm not mad at it. I was just too lazy to go to the gas station and get more bullet wraps, but this is sufficing. Suffice? Sufficient? I don't know. Anyways, we're about to cook some goddamn dinner, or I mean lunch. It's lunchtime. So I got the inspiration for this from Instagram. I know it's not a TikTok video, but I just saw this and I couldn't stop thinking about it. So as you can see, she put the cheese, the pesto, the prosciutto, all that shit on the bun and put it in the oven and baked it. And it looks really good. I think she also uh, drizzled some balsamic vinegar on top. So I bought this at the store today. I think that'll go really good with it. So yeah, y'all, I'm about to make this shit. I'm super excited. I love this cheese. I love pesto, I love prosciutto, prosciutto. I'm so bad at pronouncing shit, you guys. Like literally last week at the Mexican restaurant, I was trying to say queso and I said fucking queso. So excuse me if I don't s pronounce prosciutto, prosciutto right. Whatever the fuck. Anyways, I have my nice new coating board. So I'm gonna prepare everything on that. <laughs> cooking lunch this shit looks so fucking good i'm like actually hot about how this came out so i'm gonna try it this is actually fantastic i'm really glad i put the balsamic vinaigrette on top of the lettuce leaves because it really added a nice flavor i also really like the pesto the prosciutto is really good everything about this is amazing. I'm not gonna lie y'all, this recipe blows the breakfast one out of the water. This is so good. I highly recommend trying this at home. So that was a pretty successful lunch. Um, my dad stopped by earlier and he helped hang the TV. It's pretty damn small, but it's temporary. I really want to buy like a 50 inch TV soon because we have our big one in our bedroom and I want to leave it in here. So I like laying in bed at night and watching it. So yeah, our house has really come together. I'm super happy with it. All right, you guys, so it is officially dinner time. <laughs> and I'm so excited to make these street tacos. So I went ahead and did some preparation. I cut all the vegetables and the chicken and I seasoned them. And it's been in the fridge marinating for like the past hour. So I also just rolled up my nightly blunt and I'm so fucking excited to try this strain. So I'm smoking on some damn cereal milk. It's really cute packaging and it tastes pretty good. However, it is an indica, so I'm hoping this shit doesn't like knock me out. Like I said, I did go ahead and prepare all the chicken and vegetables like she did. And so I'm about to pick it right up here and throw my shit in the fryers until it's pretty much cooked through. And then I'm gonna throw my vegetables in just like she did. <laughs> and then throw all my tomatoes in, shred the chicken, toss that back in. So it looks like she threw some water in. And I really like how she dipped the tortillas in the meat juice. So it gives it that nice, you know, look and flavor to it. I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about.
Alrighty, you guys, so I am so excited to try these. They look so fucking good. I feel like they've more, you know, turned into quesadillas rather than fajitas, but I'm not mad at it. Cheers. Damn. This is definitely the best thing I've cooked all day. <laughs> Out of all these recipes, I think this one's my favorite. It's really tasty. Mm -hmm. 